So I'm supposed to be moving, like getting my getting my stuff ready to be moved for tomorrow. But uh, this is the last day of the Christmas event. So I'm gonna do the Christmas event and just hope that I have enough time before the end of the day. This can't be long, right? It's never that long, right? And I'm not staying up until like five in the morning to do it last minute again. This quest is for like babies, right? So any any enemy in here can't be too bad. Oh my god, yeah, this is a little minyot you get. And <laughs> my friends are like, this thing is so ugly. Why would anyone want this? And I think it's funny. I love the Yetis. And just a, a small one is perfect. I don't know if the normal one was a minion already. Because we saw the baby one in Endwalker. Uh, and I'm like, is that a minion? Well, this one is white and has a reindeer outfit. Yep. Oh, and we could talk to these guys, I guess. I guess in the echo, you know. What the heck? Why? <laughs> why? Why can't we hear him? I mean, maybe this one doesn't know how to actually use words. Also, look at that smile. It looks like the uh, the Wii U message board. What was it called? I can't believe I'm drawing a blank on this. It looks like the yeah. Reaction for that. Yeah, and un yeah. <laughs> this is also a minion you can get. That is not even an animation. <laughs> I've never seen too much shit on my adventures to be surprised by this anymore. I'm once again, this is stupid. I can literally, in Endwalker, we could understand one of these guys. Come on. The tiny snowballs he makes. Here we go again. You just mash B and then walk around. Is it Thancred? No, okay. <laughs> is it... Is it, uh... Godbert? I know Godbert was in the art for this. Does Godbert have white hair? It's like one of those things where it's like, you should know it. Because, like, you've seen him so much, but it's like... What color was my tie? It's like, uh, shit, I don't know. Yeah, it always seems like it won't take that long, and then it does. So you just empty the shelves. And it just takes a while for some reason. I mean, actually, I forget if Santa, you know, Saint Starfall, is a real character in this universe. Because that's something you think I would remember. But if he's not, he should be. Yes. I'm pretty good. A little stressed. <laughs> it's apparently supposed to rain tomorrow, which is when I want to move out. And everything we're moving out is wood. So I don't know how that goes. What? What? Okay, I guess the company action reduced rates too is active now. Okay. 
okay, weird squirrel. It's such a small squirrel, too. Like, squirrels are bigger than that. It's like a mouse squirrel. Little hamster. They could have made seasonal event look more Christmassy. All right, off we go. Yeah, also, if you if you're wondering, uh, the Gotcha Bot. No one was wondering this. The Gotcha Bot added more characters, and uh, what? Oh God, what's she called? Lady of the Lady of the Light is now a separate character from uh, Hydaelyn. And I got her. Yippee! I'm not gonna. <laughs> I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna spoil anything in Endwalker. Hopefully, but that, that was something I wanted to point out. The choir. This is what um, my mom said when it was like, Chris, you need to do something for high schools to accept you. Why not join the, the choir? Because I was at a Catholic school and you know, the church. And then the music teacher was like, you don't actually want to do this, do you? <laughs> like, you no. Know. <laughs> Snowball themed gifts, let's go. I love gifts. Um, now that I think about it, yes. Yeah, actually, yeah. <laughs> Even, like, the kindergarten school I went to was a private school. That's right, Rudy. <laughs> Not there. So you want to be a leather worker? Nope. Wait. Whatever. Whatever. Spend the money. I remember in middle school, I wanted to go to public school because I hated my school so much. And my brother went to public school. My parents didn't do it. I don't know if I, I still don't know if I should thank them or not. I'm gonna be honest, I think the problems that I had at middle school um, would have just existed in public school as well maybe even a little worse it was social anxiety you know who, who would have guessed but uh whoa you can get the bird okay cool um but yeah uh you never know maybe, maybe new maybe new people would have helped but <laughs> i don't blame my parents for not doing it because like in hindsight it's like so that's a hard decision. I like the Christmas event music. <laughs> At least I'm assuming that's what this is. Bug boy. Okay, just... It has a map now. So we're good. Actually, you know what I should do? I should, uh... Oh, so... Wind up Warrior of Light? 
now it's the original warrior wipe. Obviously. Wind up Nanamo, that's a good one. I don't think I have that. I also want to find the mail. Trader. It's got to be here, right? I don't know where the mail is in this place. There are too many icons. Whatever. We'll worry about it later. Hopefully those aren't like Christmas presents or whatever and I'm just ignoring them. No, one of them is the eat pizza emote. I know that. So I'll know what the other one might be a uh, might actually be something. I feel like if anyone got me anything though, they would have said something. No wait. You can't send gifts directly, you can only give them codes. So it can't be that, right? No, you can send people So I don't know anymore. Nice. He gave it to the Yeti? <laughs> if it's flower enough to last a while, oh my god, look at that run. Then, like, there's no way he could carry that. Also, this this guy kind of looks like the Stonks guy. At least, like, in the corner of my eye. Alright, how far away is this? Eh, we can run it. Look, a reaper has been around here. I didn't even think about how if, like, you're playing the game for the first time, you're probably going to see those a lot more than I did. Or maybe not, because, like, how many reapers are coming back to first game areas? Cause I don't think you can be reaper if you uh, aren't at Endwalker. Wow, rude! Look at how small this thing is. There's no way it could cause trouble. Like, if it was causing trouble, you could just pick it up, walk it to the door, and then punt it. <laughs> I can't get over that running animation. Alright, and that's the Christmas event. Probably not. I don't know how long this is going to take. My, like, maximum for it was, like, three hours, which is probably too much. I forget how long the other Christmas events were. Wait, where are we going? On. Okay, yeah. <laughs> like... Glowy weapons are so funny, because, like, why would you just want something that's eye strain in the shape of your weapon? Like, I do get it. I'm playing it up for laughs, but, like, still. Wow. I love couples. There's Puff of Darkness again. I still haven't done any left quests or anything, man. Like, once the game is like, all right, now do levs, I'm like, that's a new thing that I don't know about. Uh, I'm just going to stop right here. And then I never came back. Oh, yeah. I, you might be wondering, uh, Chris, patch 6.1 came out. Why aren't you playing it? Well, um, I was going to play it, but then uh, 
then I ended up deciding that it might be best to just wait until all the patches come out and I can do it with Evan. Because Endwalker taught me that I do not I do not care to do dungeons when I don't know the mechanics. I'm I'm accept it I'm accepting the fact that I just like the story and do not like the gameplay, and I think that that's fair. Um you just stop denying it. So that's what I'm gonna do. <laughs> I don't like the squirrel. Something about this squirrel I don't like, man. It's too small, it's too jittery, the way it talks. Oh my god, the squirrel already had one. They couldn't change the model. They definitely could have, but they didn't want to. I mean, I'd imagine, like, that's a re. the squirrel's a reuse thing and it's holding, like, an acorn usually. So, in order to just reuse its skeleton, they had to change the acorn. They couldn't just put nothing there. Schneeballs. No, that's not true. Gonna be honest, though, I do want some of those. I ate, like, half of a pumpkin roll cake last night that I got for my birthday. Uh, my stomach did not like it. <laughs> the fact that I ate half of it. I'm like, I don't know when it's gonna go bad. Yeah, but, like, you can talk. That's a pretty big one-up on other squirrels. I made the joke that, and that's the event, but like, once we hand these out to the children, and then like, get the epilogue, I have a feeling that that is gonna be the event, and it'll be like a 30 minute stream. <laughs> I'm just like, there's no reason not to stream it. There are no, like, spoilers or anything. But I always feel bad doing a 30-minute stream, because someone might be like, Oh, Chris went live, and then, uh... Get there, and it's already over. And then they go, oh, did his internet go down? I've had this happen to me a lot, that's why. And then, you know, gotta go to the VODs, and, uh... Go to the very end just to see if the stream cut out, and then you go, Oh, no, that's actually... A conclusion is happening right now. Interesting. I missed the stream. Honestly, though, I was kind of hoping for more uh, Christmas cosmetics. Actually, there might be. And I just didn't see. I'll check the Mog Station after this. And then probably spend money, even though I shouldn't. The reason I didn't do Christmas was because uh, I have to save money to pay for two more months of rent. By myself, that's what I want to do. <laughs> Sour, please. This looks like the end of the quest, going by the check mark. I don't see any. Oh, there's a cutscene there. Right, we started with a cutscene. Yeah, okay. This is just the end of this leg of the quest. Oh, but this is the end of the quest. Honestly, I'm like, sleeveless shirts in this game look awful. But they look kind of okay on Lollafells. Okay, where am I going to bent branch meadow? That's not in here. I remember that. This is a place near the big old tree, isn't it? It's like, I'm probably thinking of the right place, but it's probably not near the big old tree. 
I'm not thinking of the right place. Okay, never mind. Unless I am, and it's just hard to tell because it's... No, I am thinking of the right place. Because there's, the, there's the stables over there. You're just sitting. Wait, 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 wait. No, no, no. This is not what I'm... I'm not here for you. Woo! Yeah, this is... This is the deep... This is like that one Christmas outfit that I don't like. <laughs> it looks so cheap. It looks like you bought it at uh, Party City. If it was all I had, then I would wear it. But it's not all I have. I have this awesome robe. You know, just like Christmas. Uh, where are we going? And where am I relative to that? Okay, we we are relatively close. Hey, Gavin. But look at it. Can't it? Cannot eat you. <laughs> Off he goes. Whoop. This is mountable. I said this is mountable. Oh yeah, I can fly too. Thank you for the reminder. Man, I knew something was wrong with this stream. I'm so zoomed in. But I guess I kind of have to be to see Rudy. Capybara! Capybara! Actually, thank you, God. These are probably. If they're just. Like, basically just made out of sugar, these are probably so bad for you. I misclicked again. Yeah, yeah. I'm ready to ruin these guys' cutscene with my whale. Yeah, you're <laughs> you're right. This isn't in America. How bad can the sugar be? Like they can't make it with any. Uh, Substances that are illegal in other countries. They're throwing snowballs at us. Oh, it's so cold. One of them went down my neck. Oh. Hey, no, no spoon, no end walker spoon. <laughs> That's nice. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> really? Do you really do you really think that? Give them what for? That's not in the Christmas spirit. I love their teeth. Like, they look like human teeth, and then they roar, and it looks more like baleen. 
It's probably like just the model stretching to accomplish it, but. <laughs> Even they do the surprise Final Fantasy XIV face. That's so funny. Probably like, was that good? That'll do, Yeti. That'll do. I'm sure, like, we're gonna have to give them all, like, ten of them. If they even want to taste anything. No, no Shadowbringer spoilers. <laughs> I hate you, little squirrel. All's well that ends well. What a, what a cinematic moment. Oh my god, it's him! <laughs> That'll do, Yeti. That'll do. I was kind of hoping we get more, but uh, that works. <laughs> kind of is. It's like, this tiny squirrel having this kind of text box, like, I don't know, I feel like, <laughs> one, it's very messy, it looks like, you know, in comic books, the spiky text boxes that are usually used for yelling and stuff, that's my immediate reaction, and then when I notice it, I'm like, don't, like, bad guys usually use this? Not all the time, but, I don't know, it's just sinister. I dare say. <laughs> and we'll never see him ever again. Whoa, what the hell? Off he goes. But that's not the end of the quest. Is that like, you'll see him next year? I don't know, probably. That explains why the other person teleported. Makes sense, makes sense, makes sense. <gasps> Delivery Moogle. It was just covered by everything else. And on the other screen, you really can't zoom in that much. So we'll finish the quest, do the delivery moogle, eat some pizza, which is probably what I'm going to do after the stream ends. And then, uh... One more Christmas surprise. Now that I think about it. I kind of unfortunate that I'm doing this after Christmas, but you know, whatever. <laughs> God, why does it move like that? Here, take the minions. Oh, I thought he was just gonna be over there. We have no surprise, Godbert. Wait. Oh, no, hold on. 
Oh. Sure. But it's not over yet. Surprise Godbert. He's real. Just like Santa. Okay. Change of plans. We are going to do this first, though. Thanks for playing Final Fantasy XIV. Enclosed are a death scythe. <laughs> a death scythe. Aryan horn and wind up Poram. Or is that a wind up Palom? No, it's a wind up Poram. I, I don't know what this is. This is a death scythe, though. I guess I'll take it. Eat pizza. Oh, it's ballroom etiquette, too, of course. Eating pizza is etiquette. But why, why do I, why do I have it? That's what I'm over here wondering. I'm keeping the Lady of the Light, by the way. I'm not using these guys, at least not yet. It was a pre-order item? A little late for that, isn't it? Then again, the game only just got back to a stable, uh, like a st stable, uh... Why am I blanking on a word? Whatever. A stable state. I booted up the game and I was like, Oh crap, I should have booted up the game a little sooner. There are only 60 people in the queue. A far cry from like... What? Three weeks ago? I mean, if anyone would be Santa, though, I do think it's really funny that's Godbert. Except for that one time. But we don't talk about that one Godbert moment. Okay, hello. What are you getting at? <laughs> oh, and they're gone. Okay. Ho, ho, ho. Uh, <laughs> oh no, 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 I thought we were done with this. You may choose from among six of the saints desired destinations. Uh, do I have to remember this? Falls, Lancers Guild, Leatherworks Guild, Marketplace, Watermill. I don't know where this is. I can at least navigate myself to the other ones. You can leave the saint behind. <laughs> you know, the saint. Actually, the falls is where you get the achievements, right? I was like, it could be here, it could be there. Oh, they mark it. Okay, good. I wish I remembered the brand of the pizza, but I was told that um, there's one brand of pizza that is like frozen pizza that is like better than the rest you know what i'm actually i'm gonna go i'm gonna go check it out i haven't i can't vouch for it myself i haven't eaten it yet but give me a sec Who is It's called Home Run Inn. Home Run Inn Pizza. The cheese pizza apparently isn't that good, but then you get like the sausage one. The other ones, apparently it rocks. So I'm gonna have that in between moving stuff in boxes. <laughs> All 
Aren't you, like, not wearing any pants? <laughs> exactly. Yes, please make more Christmas cosmetics. Christmas and winter cosmetics, please. I find it really funny that you only have to go to one place. <laughs> I can't get over the picture. Anyway. Oh god. Um, I'm going to assume that the rest of these are the other spots. So we're going to go to that. We're going to go to those. Have some conversations. I like how you can like see his... I guess it's not underwear, but like, like that skirt is doing nothing. It's not really a skirt, is it? It's more of a, uh, can you follow me? Yes. It's more of a tunic, am I right? This Christmas tree is kind of sad. <laughs> uh, Santa doesn't gamble. <laughs> is he like worried that there are people around who will listen to him, or is he worried that he's gonna spoil the surprise for me and that I don't know? I love how the game is constantly like, uh, head back, head back to the place. Wait, what the, what the heck is that? I don't think I've ever been over there. No, I had to have been at some point. Oh, you know what? That's like when you, okay, okay, I get it. Conjurer's guild thing. And there's nothing in New Gridania, right? Because you can't bring him there because it's a scene transition. Or a screen transition. Or really just a transition. Let's go! Yep, so this is where the achievement guy is. Right? That guy? I have no idea how I remember that. Like, the waterfall isn't really that big either. So I don't know why it stuck out to me. This is like a banjo tui waterfall. What if we get the children water for Christmas? They're so dehydrated, they never remember to drink water. They're like, oh no, I went 18 hours without drinking water all day. I find it interesting that the, f like, the closest area is the one that gives him the inspiration. At least I'm assuming that's how it's gonna go. This isn't where I want to go. We'll just loop around anyway. I guess. <laughs> Wait, Han, where are the, uh... Weren't there other ones? The marketplace and stuff? Or am I only allowed to visit three at a time? I guess I'll do that then. It did have a, the quest icon did have a recycle icon over it, which I don't think I've seen before. I'm assuming that just means you could do the quest as many times as you want to get as many uh, packets of whatever as you want. Still crowded here. People love this. 
hellhole. <laughs> what can you say? People love hallways with a market board in it. Is it me or is like, oh, I was gonna say is the place less decorated, but you do get this, I think for doing this quest. Wait, I can't. No, I've gone too far. Look, it's wind up Rudy. I hate that sound, man. I guess we're going down there. You know, it's kind of interesting. Like, normally this, like, accompanying thing sucks because you can't move fast or whatever. So you think... Hey, you're in this area where you can't move fast anyway, so it won't be that bad, right? I feel like that somehow makes it worse, though. <laughs> you know what? I think the real problem is that uh, you don't have a companion for this long. Normally. It's usually just walk from point A to point B, and it's like basically that short. I mean, I guess it wouldn't be that bad if uh, all the points were still on the map, but they aren't. I got a text from Luke. That's, like, concerning. He's gonna be like, hey, I'm gonna do something that inconveniences you. That's basically the only reason he ever texts me now that I think about it. Also, I love this little stone pedestal here. You know, he's also perfect because he, uh, he does have, he is handy, you know, he has his hammer and stuff. It was enter entertaining. It was exhausting. Must we parse, part so soon? We had, like, about three more things to look at. Come on, it'll be fun. <laughs> Come on, it'll be fun. I mean, I am a healer, so this should work. Well, I'm a white mage specifically, so this should work. Why is he saying that? Because he like, <laughs> he like sneezed on, yeah, sneezed. Will you open your eyes? No. He definitely sneezed on my face. But you feel like I would have heard that, right? I'm not a white man, though. Christmas cosmetics. That works. Perfect for my Animal Crossing town. You know, it's been a while since I've seen a real snow globe. Like, we used to have one when I was a kid. But I don't know where that went. And then also, no one else has ever had one. Snow globes are good. I like how that <laughs> the tunic clips through his arm. That's very scary. 
Apparently the Moon Brita, um, the Moon Brita hair, like, it has ears, like, your ears clip out of it. It's like, man, that sucks. Maybe when I grow old, I'll collect snow globes. I mean, that's the thing. I had, in, uh, junior year of high school, I had an English teacher who collected old Coca-Cola bottles that still had Coca-Cola in them, I think. And, uh, he was like... What was it? It's like every... Every grown man will collect something at some point. And I'm like, I still don't have anything. And right now, I'm still like, I don't have anything. I guess I can collect uh, video games that I'll never play, but... It's definitely not going to be anime figures. But maybe it'll be snow globes. Because, you know, you have, like, souvenir spoons and stuff. Souvenir snow globes. The problem is no one sells any snow globes, either. Like I said, I've never seen them around, not even in gift shops. Sunshine. Wait, wh how do I get the... How do I get the hanging thing for my room that I'm never gonna use? Ever. That was fast. I have a few as well, and then I realized that, like, after three days, I never really look at them anymore because they just kind of blend in with the room and then you go wow that two hundred dollars was kind of wasted so uh i don't get them anymore and then i also had the realization that you don't need merchandise to prove how much you like a character or thing so like that also took a hit to the anime figure market for me but you know that's just me for other people they probably look at it all the, their figures all the time and it makes them happy and stuff All right, so go up there. Two of the same figure. Speaking of moving and anime figures, I was told to keep the boxes for moving, and maybe that was a good idea. I haven't put them in the boxes yet, but like that's something. Like uh, the amiibo those are going to be a problem. I'm afraid they're going to break. <laughs> Other figures that don't have cases. Like this one Hatsune Miku I have with like her hair twirling around her entire body. And the hair is very thin. I'm, I'm always afraid that's going to break off. But I can't give them their own boxes. So this is leather work. Maybe he's going to have the same inspiration to make clothes again. And the two close, like the two closest ones, depending on which direction you go, will give him the inspiration. Maybe not. There are few greater pleasures in life than exchanging presents with friends and loved ones. Amen. A oh man that I'm making that the thumbnail. I don't even care if you can't read it. I'm making that the thumbnail. Anyway, speaking of presents, <laughs> if someone does want to get me a figure though, then uh that does spark more joy than when I buy one myself. Even when Gavin got me the Nico one as like out of spite, and I still look at it and I go Gavin got that for me. Smile. I'll never turn down a gifted figure. That's for sure. Something, <laughs> something that would disappoint me as far as like gifts go is food food is so fleeting like and yet it costs sometimes it costs as much as like a permanent item and you go like man i wish like because you know you're not you're not gonna remember you're not you're probably not gonna remember that because it's food there's so much good food 
it's like just kind of depressing. Obviously, I don't I don't say anything about it, but uh, oh, it's funny music. I go thank you for the food, and it almost definitely tastes good. I'm just saying like, that's my advice to you. I would not give people food for birthday or Christmas. Like, you, even if you bake it, that that has a lot more meaning to it for sure. But like. Once it's gone, it's gone, you know? Even, like, something that gets used and then becomes useless, like, I don't know. Well, something like that that's not expensive. <laughs> like, at least, you know, you use it probably for a long amount of time or whatever. It's helpful, f it's helpful to you. Like... The food is going to be helpful to you for the next, like, four hours, and then you get hungry again. I'm just saying. I'm, I'm just saying, okay? Do you want a Figma of Kaito? Not really. Like, I don't actually listen to Vocaloid stuff. I like uh, Rin and Len a lot. I did used to listen to them when I was a teenager, but I don't really listen anymore. Uh, Miku does have that ubiquity, though. And everyone draws her in every possible style and outfit and stuff. It's very good. And then she has official, like, outfits for everything as well. <laughs> so it's like, like I said, very ubiquitous character. So I'm like, yeah, I'll buy a figure. That I think that was, like, my first figure, actually. So I don't do much shopping. I buy materials from time to time. It used to be belts. That's so funny, because they removed belts as a thing you can equip when Endwalker came out. I do love the wording on that, though. I do buy materials from time to time. Is that meant to be that robotic? I guess because it's an RPG, but like, just the phrasing sounds so robotic. It's very good. Oh, it means for crafting. Shit! That is the least me option on there. <laughs> okay, thank god I can at least do the one at the Lancer's Guild. Yes, Christmas Tree Miku is always my favorite. Anime girls with Christmas tree hair. Top tier. Best, uh, best kind of Christmas. Cosmetic question mark. Outfit. Idea. Are these guys always doing push-ups? I feel like they are. <laughs> a rotisserie chicken is kind of a funny present, but... I guess just because it's so big and it's, you know, a rotisserie chicken. Maybe one day I'll make a rotisserie chicken. Myself. Because I have no idea how you do that. Off he goes. Now this is what Godbird is all about. <laughs> Honestly, that's a very good thumbnail too. Ho, ho, ho. I find it interesting because I feel like the last one we talked to him about um, didn't inspire him at all, and they're like, "Well, well, go back to the thing." This is this is not correct. Good thing no one saw that. Um, would it be faster to go down or up? Let's go up. This is the path less traveled, even though it's definitely longer because it go you know 
arches upwards. But yeah, top tier Christmas presents. A memento that they can just always look at. Or something that they need. Like some, something that they actually need. That is my recommendation to you. Food F tier. <laughs> Food made by hand E tier. Wait. Yeah, okay. No, that's right. Usually tier lists don't go down to F. Like, everyone says F tier, but usually they don't actually go that far down. It's usually like D at the bottom, E at most. So I was like, wait a second. Yeah, meanwhile, I'm like, you know, I have my, uh, oh, oh shit. You know, how I have all my posters and, uh, like, I, I got a bunch of posters of the secret, the art that secret did for me. I'm over here like, I have to take those down from the wall before uh, my dad comes into my room to help me move. And then I'm like, do I put them up when I'm living at my parents? Or is that some, like, they're just going to have to collect dust for a bit. I don't know. I mean, like... My grandma always used to have, like, dolls and stuff. I'm just waiting for the generation where all the old people decorate their retirement homes with uh, anime figures and dendroids and stuff. It's gonna happen. You know it's gonna happen. I'm keeping the 100% orange juice plushies on my bed though they can they can think i'm a weirdo all they want i think it's nice i was like what else am i gonna do with all of them what is that sound <laughs> We get it, Gavin. Your mom loves you. <laughs> uh, that that is always like everyone's dream, though, right? That their parent parents are accepting of things like video games and anime. I tried one time; it failed. So, uh, I just kind of. I kind of regret it, <laughs> but whatever. I was so confident. I was so confident that they were going to be accepting of it. And they were like, uh, like they didn't like beat it down, but they were like, uh, and I was like, shit, shouldn't have done this. So you gotta, you gotta make sure that's going to work. All right, I think we saw everything. So now it's this is what uh, Christmas is truly about. We're going to the gold source. Uh, um, uh, over here. I'm never gonna know. I'm never gonna know for sure. Like you could probably look at the ground. And go like, yeah, it's the one with the design. I will never know. Alright. 
It's time for a Christmas miracle. Shit! The seven was supposed to be here along with the nine. Or maybe here with the nine. Well, that's unfortunate. Oh, speaking of unfortunate... Wait, it can still be here. It can still be here. Fuck you. Five. Six. I, I, I don't like you. What if I just... Oh, I was gonna say, what if I just leave that there? One. No. Yes. No. Christmas is a sham. All right, well, that was a fun little thing. Fun little thing. It was, it was an hour. It was at least an hour. Hooray. Uh, I'm going to end the stream and start moving and uh, we'll start putting things in boxes and be stressed out about that and then move and then um, hopefully I'll be in my parents by the new year and then because it's the new year, the new year's resolution, of course, is to be more productive and not just sit and watch Northern Lion. But like, you never know, but also like, I'll hopefully have a better environment for it and if I don't, then I will make sure that I soundproof that room until it's good enough. I will not give up, and then that'll be helpful. And then, uh, yeah, actually, what, what, what did Luke say? Speaking of that, speaking of all that, time to, time to drag him through the mud once again. Wait, he says, after you went to sleep, John and I talked about Sea of Thieves. Wait, this is actually good news. This is good news, but he didn't say anything about wanting to play it. But yeah, the Sea of Thieves, the Sea of Thieves has like this Christmas, not Christmas, there's this bonus Golden Glory event going on until like Monday. And I want to do that with Evan, but I'm also moving. So that might happen. Um, we'll see how it goes. Yeah, we could help each other pack. Is this replacing the Christmas gotchas? Oh, I see. <laughs> the cacked pot. I mean, honestly, I'm improving. You can tell I'm improving because this year I did not try to um, buy and get every single gotcha Halloween outfit, you know? So that's good. I'm not gonna list off all the gotcha games I play because the idea is I'm not supposed to talk about them so people don't want to play them because someone they know is playing them so that they might not spend money. And sometimes I trip up on it, but that's the thing. Yeah, I don't know what I'm doing about my computer. I think I'm, we're moving all the big stuff out tomorrow. Hopefully, maybe, if it's not raining, perhaps. And then once that's guaranteed there, then I'll move my computer and monitors. I have no idea what I'm doing with my monitors. Am I keeping the arms attached to the desk or am I unattaching the arms with the monitors on them? I don't know. I don't know. It's, it's just, I'm just gonna, we're gonna do that. So. Uh, with that, I'm going to leave and start packing because I have to. Goodbye.